Welcome back to Educator.com's English Grammar course. This lesson is on active versus passive voice. Let's get started. All right, we're going to start with a brief lesson overview. We're going to ask what is the active voice, what is the passive voice, when, and then we're going to cover when to use active and when to use passive. Now, you've probably been told in class, never ever use the passive voice, it's terrible. But there are actually certain circumstances where you should use it. So we're going to talk about when it's appropriate. But to begin with, what, what's this voice thing? Well, in the active voice, a sentence written in the active voice, the subject of the sentence actively performs the action. This is the kind of sentence you see most often, active voice. So, William Shakespeare wrote Hamlet, my favorite play. The subject is William Shakespeare, and the predicate is wrote Hamlet, my favorite play. Shakespeare is the person who wrote Hamlet, so it's in the active voice. Similarly, your dog, subject, chased my cat into Fred's yard today. Your dog performed the action of chasing my cat. All right, well, if that's the active voice, what's the passive voice? Well, in the passive voice, the subject of the sentence receives the action, and the agent of the action is removed or displaced. So, Hamlet, my favorite play, was written by William Shakespeare. Well, now the subject is Hamlet, and the predicate is was written by William Shakespeare. So the subject actually receives the action. This is not as strong a construction as active voice. Similarly, my cat was chased into Fred's yard by your dog today. Well, if you're having an argument with somebody, you're probably going to put your dog right at the beginning. It's weaker to say, my cat was chased into Fred's yard by your dog. It's wordy, it's confusing, you get lost about who did what. It's in the passive voice. All right, let's do a little practice before we go any further. See if you can look at these sentences and determine whether they're in the active or the passive voice. The judges have selected a winner. The winner will be announced tomorrow. A prize of $10,000 will be given to the winner. Take a good look, pause the video if you need to. All right, the judges have selected a winner, that is active. The action is have selected, and the subject judges, who's done the selection?